Howdy folks, Nathan Cranzo here with my friend Lloyd. Hey bud. Lloyd, thanks for showing up. <laughs> this is gonna be pretty cool because I just happen to have a deck of cards here and I'll show you they're all different, all different cards. And I'll have you pick anyone you like. Absolutely free choice. There's no wrong answer. And you happen to have a pen? Yeah, I do. I will actually, you know, you can put your name, initials, whatever you'd like. I was gonna ask you to uh, just put some type of identifying mark. I won't look. It's okay. And you might hear some, uh, some horns and some uh, sirens in the background, or even a stabbing. And that's because we're in New York City and just the charm and the nature of the city. So we're very lucky to be here. And Lloyd's here, and he's gonna put his card on top, and I'll give it a quick shuffle. Shuffle the deck, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And at this point, I will ask you one question, and I will tell you what your card is. One question. What is the name of your card? Just kidding. <laughs> that'd be too easy. Even though technically that is one question, that'd be a little bit too easy. So how about this? Um, just name a number between one and ten. Uh, no six, wrong answer. Six. six? Perfect. Yeah, six. I will cut the deck six times behind my back. And when I do that, I should be able to, at the sixth cut, bring your card to the top of the deck. So there's one, two, three, four, five. And we'll do the last one out in the open. Six. Oh, sometimes I mix this around. What was the name of your card? Four of so close. It's like horseshoes and hangar days, right? It doesn't have your... <laughs> I'm so good at getting close. I don't even see it in the deck anywhere. I think sometimes this gets mixed around. So I'll give you the deck. I'll show you my hands are completely empty. Sometimes the card will actually dematerialize and reappear somewhere strange. So I haven't gone anywhere near this pocket, but I'll show you once again my hands empty. Inside here I have a wallet. And inside there is a uh, rubber banded area. You can open that up. I'll take the deck. And if you just open, there's a driver's license, there's my uh, money, and underneath there is a card. And if that's got your name on it, that'd be pretty scary. What if I got a guy that doesn't have my name? <laughs> Four diamonds. Hold it up to the camera. <laughs> Not only did I predict what card you would pick, but I predicted exactly how you'd sign your name. I didn't think it was going to be a guy. It's a double whammy. <laughs> High five. <laughs>